All right. Time for more, time for more gameplay. We're playing the game. We took yesterday off because, I don't know, my body just felt like being easy, I guess. About the, what, the, what, the, what the body want to do. The dying words of Lord Hellman stunned Elliwood beyond belief. Darren, the Marcus of Laos knows all. Despite the pain it brings, Elliwood takes this newfound knowledge to heart. Let's out for Laos once again. A way to Laos, he travels through a Kalawalan village. Elliwood and his party decide to rest there for a night. Okay. Number 13, why? Adler Merlinus. Oh boy. Ah, dark already. We'll have to stop here for the night. We'll set out for Laos at the first sign of sunlight. Marcus, prepare the camp. Yes, my lord. So, this is Calavan. Do you think we ought to present ourselves to Lord House Hong? We're simply passing through, so I don't see the need. I'm curious how Lindis is uh, getting along, though. Lindis? Marcus Calavan's granddaughter. Oh, her. The missing heir who dug with Lundgren last year. Didn't you have something to do with that? Hmm, maybe. And the granddaughter? Is she a beauty? A beauty? She's... I don't... She's... I think it must be her heritage. She's... Striking. Striking? Too bad, isn't it? What? But we don't have the time to see her, lover boy. Oh, there's no the in there. My bad. No! Lindis and I are... We're not. You're not? Then why are you getting so worked up? Hector! Don't make me angry! <laughs> I did five for some reason. You're so much fun to tease. Huh, what was that? Did you hear something? It was a scream. I didn't hear shit. Someone's being attacked. Do we help? Of course! I know someone! Help! Ah, uh, stupid old fool. He's kept us running in circles for hours. Hi, my valuable merchandise! What are you going to do? Hey, look at this. The old fool's wealthy. Huh, huh, huh. Our lucky day, huh? It pays on Popo's hand. What? What's his name? Let go! Let go! Will you let go? What a racket! Who's on? Can you get rid of this simple tin? I suppose so. There ain't no reason to let him live. Oh my! Release him! Who? I told you to let the man go! If you move quickly, we'll let you live. Ah, uh, parent dandies like you, you know what I think. Living all your parents' names, prancing about, I despise you. Come on, don't hold back. We'll kill you all. Oh, it's dark. Aye! You, they call you Dumbledore, am I right? I am Merlinus, a humble and lonely merchant. I know nothing of combat. Please, you must protect me. He gonna get his ass beat. Yes, he is. All right, we got all my friends here. They got Dumbledore's over there. Guessing they're gonna knock this shit down and come from that way. Probably gonna be people over here coming from that way. We're gonna, uh, we need to kill this archer ASAP for sure. Times two, get your ass out of here. Flip. Flap. He did. Me that XP. 
This dork ass? Nope, this is this is the the XP monster himself. This dude got so much XP in the last map. I remember I was there. Yeah, 92, he's almost level five. Jesus. Um Actually you know what? No, let's not do that. Archer's not gonna do 10, but we need XP on the Archer. Yep. Or do we? Maybe not, I don't know. Let's do this. Maybe the Archer will crit. Yeah, only seven. Crit, lady! Oh. oh, well, XP's XP, I guess. Uh, we're just gonna send Big Dick McRick here. Eat the shit out of this guy. Yeah, he's just dead. Get out of here. Nobody up there. Ah, oh, damn, I can't go over that way. Not far enough. Send this dude over here, start posturing up on these dudes, because I'm guessing these are just gonna continuously summon some shit. Oh, is this guy? Great. Move her up here. Or do I? Maybe not, I don't know. Put Hectoro in El Foresto. Let's scout with this dude, see what's going on over here. Nothing apparently. Um We'll hide this dude in the bushes. The door gas in the bushes too. This guy up here with this dude. Look at a level by killing this guy, right? Probably save me some damage. Might as well. What? That's cheating! Wait. No, he doesn't have avoidance on the bridge. He just got lucky. What an asshole. There's a village way up there. These are forts. I'm guessing there's dudes up here. One out of seven turns. Alright. Um. Wait, where'd this third guy come from? Is there always a third guy here? I thought there was only two. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't want to leave her down here, but uh, Dork Ass has healing. I don't know who, who else got healing. That's, that's the question. That dude does not have healing, he's got healing, he's got all the healing. That dude's got healing. Hell, don't got no healing. Big Buddy's got healing. Cuss. Don't need healing because he's freaking already classed up or whatever. That dude got healing. Archer got healing. XP Buddy's got some healing. Hecator's got some healing. So yeah, those two don't have healing, but everybody else pretty much does or doesn't need it. So I think we're gonna leave her over here with these guys. And if anything, we can just start moving everybody around. Did that guy just walk on the water? Did he just miss again?
Oh, he actually got hit. That is unfortunate. Uh, this might be bad. Ah, uh, we're fine. Alright, we need to run his ass back. It's out. Guy's dead. Bye. Oh, he didn't die? He has 22? Oh, he hit him twice. <laughs> Never mind. Ah, uh, your turn, eh? Alright. That was that problem. I think we're gonna send Dumbledore right here over to the village. Kill this guy with the archer to get some XP, hopefully. Thank you, Lord. Okay. I need to run his ass back ASAP. Um, she has to be next to him. Kill this dude up. She'll be blocked from the other guys unless they walk across the damn water again. Like assholes. Bunch of scumbags. Alright, so... Orgas has a hand axe. But we could potentially just stand here and just start shooting a dude. Well... Gotcha, bitch. When he comes flying over, it'll be great. We'll stand this dude just on the bridge. Uh, thief buddy can go here. Hecator. Not sure what I want to do with Hecator. I think I actually want to send this guy up this way. I'm not sure why, but I got a feeling he needs to be up here. Maybe we should send him down here to assist. On this side. Alright, let's do that. Let's scout up this way with Big Buddy. Because <clears throat> these dudes are all going to be flying across here in a second anyway after they bust all these trees next turn. So we'll just get him set up here in this forest. XP Buddy can go in this forest. Buddy, we don't want dying wants to go in that forest. Wait. Why was that guy almost dead? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> oh no! Two damage! Does he go twice? No, he just goes once. Okay. Okay, well, he should be fine. Bye. I guess just walk up and die too. Okay, not bad. It sucks that he used a hand axe, but here we are. Should be dead. What? There you go. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's gonna do it. Never mind. I don't know why I got scared. I was like, oh, Archer, buddy, I'm gonna die. No, nope, he's fine. So the sword buddy didn't come up here. I guess that guy came up here and. killed himself. Oh shit. Alright, you know what? Uh 
Actually, no, we probably don't need to have people down here blocking. Let's go ahead and, uh... I have an idea. Where can she go? Where can he go? Alright, let's do this. We're gonna block. This right here with these three. Oh, but they can break that shit right there, too. You know what? I think we're just gonna pull back. We're gonna pull back here. Send this dude over this way, the village. Show does this guy have 16? If he kills him, I'm going in. Why is my sword blinking? Does that mean I leveled up my whip on? Don't mean shit! That just dies? Having him right in the face? Alright, we got an axe buddy right there, that's fine. Uh, let's bring... Go back down. All right. That dude backed up. This guy's dead. I need to back this guy up and get him some health. Damn, he's using the hand axe again. He took nine. Ugh. Leveled up though, so that's nice. That's it. No stir. Get that shit out of here. The forest, the forest. I'm actually not sure if I'll be able to get there. Because if I can only go to the edge of the darkness. Here, I might be able to get there in two turns. Well, three turns on the last turn. Maybe. All right, we need to pull this guy back because he's almost dead. Let's move Hecator down one. Oh wait, I'm not gonna be able to heal him now, am I? Shit. Well, it's fine. We can just do this. Move her up here and then we can block her in with a uh, hail of wood. Even though Ella Wood can't die, definitely don't want her dying. Right? Right. 
Actually, let's just do this guy right here to help Ella Wood. Just in case. How much does this guy have? Nine. Uh, Dorkass needs to be healed. I think he's got a 16 hit rate. I highly doubt he'll get hit. Yeah, no way. I just kind of want to get him some XP. Just in case. That dude's almost dead, but I think we need to back up. The only thing is, is if I back up... Well, no, he should be fine. Like, if the other guy only had the 15 hit rate or something, he should be okay. The only thing is, is he's probably gonna get smashed by the archer too. I need XP. He's like a little eight or something, right? Yeah, whatever. That's fine. Oh, uh, she's in turn. It should be fine. Definitely should be fine. Oh, he can actually go all the way up there. All right, good. I'm actually curious. That's it? Well, never mind then. You can kill him with Mateo. Give me that sweet XP! Alright, not bad, not bad. Alright, uh... I don't really want to move anyone else. Except for, I should probably move these two back in here. Anybody need health? This dude needs health. pretty much all I want to do with my turn. Um, we can probably set up to get this guy healed. Next turn. For right now, let's just go ahead and end. Fine. Two damage is nothing. The guy is dead, apparently. Yeah, they break that. Is there anybody else there? I'm actually curious. I kind of want to go out here and see what happens. But I know there's going to be a dude right here, and if I try to go, like, further... Actually, you know what I should do? Let's do this. Oh, but I can't see him. I'm not going to let me shoot. But now I can see him! Ekator. Oh. One times two. Fuck it. You missed! Why? 
I take two damage because you're bad. Whatever, everything's fine. In here and visit this place because it might be something special. Oh my! Those ruffians are attacking you! Our village is in danger too! We talked it over and. Here! All the money we collected! Go chase out the bandits, it's yours! Damn! I am okay with that. Wait in the forest here. Um. Go ahead and get dork ass some healing. Okay. All right. Um, I think we're pretty much good here. We just gotta wait. I'm guessing this guy's probably gonna attack. No damage. And hopefully he kills him and gets some XP. Other than that, I don't really know anything else to do. Just wait for the mission to end. Ow! Got him. Leveled up. Wonderful. Level 3. Yeah, defense is nice, because I think if he dies, the game ends too, right? So... Oh, shit! Ah! Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Oh, he needs another land soon. Kinda want somebody else to get XP, honestly. Oh, four. Oh, three. Will he kill him, though? I don't know. I got so lucky that that dude missed that first shot. That is 11. Get your ass out of here! Nice! Oh, worry, little buddy, I got you! Woo! Okay. Wait, did I ever heal this guy? Okay. Alright, there. Now he can't be shot. <laughs> All right, everything's fine. I think uh, we just didn't turn it, that's it, right? Yeah. Just die. Oh, maybe not. Whatever, it's fine. That's the only guy on the map. Why is I won't forget this? And you're smarter than you look. Get out of here. Are you all right? Hmm? Oh, I, I've been saved. We've driven them off. Are you injured? I only got an arrow in my ass, but other than that, I'm okay. No, uh, not at all. As you can see, I'm as fine as fine can be. I'm glad to see that then. Wait, that then? Oh, there is a then down there, but not up there. Understood. I'm glad to see that. We'll take our leave then. Let's go, Hector. Oh, wait a moment, please. A token of my thanks. Do not worry yourself. We did nothing to merit reward. That's right. Keep no need of a peddler's junk. <laughs> Die! Peddler? Hector. Oops! Ahem! I am Melinus! 
You'll find no other traveling merchant whose goods compare. Don't let your eyes fool you. I'm quite prosperous. Oh, you're a merchant. Books and knives and all that, eh? Hector, your manners are terrible. Berlinus, please. I don't mind what this oaf has to say. No, of course not. I wasn't concerned at... Ahem! <laughs> By the way, you two obviously come from highborn houses. Would you grant me the honor of your names? I am Meliwood, son of the Marcus of Foray. I am Hector, Marcus, Ostia's brother. Goodness, Ostia, Foray! The greatest houses in all of Lycia! Ah, to be saved by noble men such as yourselves is an honor beyond words. It's nice to be appreciated for a change. Lately, people just seem to want to stand. Tell me, Melillus, what are your plans? Pardon? My plans, my lord. I had planned to travel like a son of my merchandise, but... May not be possible in such dangerous times. If that's the case, why don't you come along with us? Hector! Our travels will not be ending anytime soon. We've gained more people and more items, right? It'd be good to have help managing our things. Oh, now that is a splendid idea. Managing merchandise is my specialty, after all. Are you sure? Quite sure, my lord. To be honest, I have dreamed of working for a noble house. To have my fondest wish granted in such a way, I cannot stem these tears of joy. Lord Hector, Lord Eliwood, take me into your bosoms and keep me safe forever. Uh, thank you. Well met, Melinus. We are counting on you. Now, I've got some things I want you to carry. Yes, of course. Whatever you have, Melinus will keep. All right. False friends. I mean, I'm gonna get betrayed right now. A droll merchant named Melinus now joins Eliwood's group. With Melinus in tow, they set out for Laos the following day. Laos is located in the heart of Ligia, a territory ruled by the power hungry Marcus of Laos, Lord Darin. Preparations for the war of which the Farian magistrate spoke. The disappearance of Eliwood's father, Elbert. The death of Marcus Santarus. Do these all revolve around Lord Darin? In Eliwood's heart, the need for truth is drowned in fear. A fear of what that truth may hold. Oh, spam. Chapter 15. Oh, 14. Damn. I was close. I thought it was 15 because it's a stupid side quest. Side quest doesn't count. Are you certain? Or is heirs here? Yes, father. We've just received word from our lookouts. He's still be on that hill, but he'll be here before long. Lord Erfadel, what is the meaning of this? Perhaps when they reached Santaros Castle, Lord Helman was still clinging to life. You can't be serious. He couldn't have lasted too long, but maybe he told them something. That's terrible. A plan. It's all for naught, isn't it? No need to be so alone, my lord. Even if he told young Eliwood something about schemes, for he no longer has the power. All Eliwood could do is perhaps inform Marcus Ostia. Ostia? That would be ruinous. Lord Uther may be young and due to the throne, but he's dangerous. That out of pain and hireman, he was a coward to the end. Betray us now, and we're so close. We only need a little more time to complete our plans for rebellion. And before Marcus Austria becomes aware of any of this, uh, you would do so. Do do so. Do so. Would do well to stop them here. Yes, you're right. Of course, we do have a chance. They have to pass through Laos to get Austria. We can still silence them. They must not pass, no matter the cost. Let us make haste to call up our finest troops. Father, please let me take the command. Eric, uh, tell me, son, can you succeed? 
Thank God, other would or not, I started getting another one else there. He's a trusting fool. If he sees me, he'll lower his guard. And what he does, we strike. I see. I beg your pardon, is this not too much for him? If by strange chance he fell, things could turn for the worse. Oh, I know I'm the lad's father, but I act quite clever, I tell you. Nothing for his will will be no trouble at all. It's settled, it's up to you now, Eric. Bring me the head of Foray's darling son. Yes, Lana, I will not fail you. Look around, they truly are preparing for battle. Wait, what did he say? What did he say? Ah! Marcus Laws, want to see you scheming? Don't much look like you want to go to the castle. If we go and learn the truth, we may have to go to war. That's fine with me. I have no love for war. If I concentrate on the foe before me, I'm fine. My picture families, innocents, got up in our foolish politics. I imagine them. All I can do is pray for a way to solve things peacefully. Anyway. Lord Elwood, a knight has ridden forth from the castle! Hello, knight! Yes, my lord. Our scouts say it's Marcus Law's son, Eric! He's asking to see you. Eric? Ugh, why did it have to be that buffoon? I will see him! Bring him here! I am leaving. I never could abide him. I'll go for a ride in some surroundings. He's gonna try to kill me. Hello, it's been a long time, my neighborhood. Eric, what is your business? My business? What do you mean? I heard my old friend was here in Laos. I merely thought I'd ride down to greet you. So tell me, friend, what brings you to Laos? Are you on your way to Austria? Hmm, why would you think that? Well, you were always such good friends with Hector. He and I never got along very well. Poor noble, his baby was crude in his manner of speech. Could have thought him a villain on first glance. You're still friends with Hector, aren't you? Uh, when did you see him last? How do you communicate? Eric, you're after something. What is it? Fun? Everywhere I look, Laos prepares for battle. What are you and your father planning? I will know the truth! I hope to wait until you told me of Ostia, of whether you've spoken with the Marcus or not. What are you talking about? <laughs> in a word, I have always despised you. I have longed to smash you in your pathetic morality into pieces. I have dreamed of this day, and here it is at last. Too bad you're not lived to see the end of it. Hector! Y you Hector! You couldn't. Have you spoken with Ostia already? Maybe we have, maybe we haven't. Anyway, this mongrel has troops lying in ambush all around us. House regulars, everyone. We're in for a rough time. <laughs> There's no the point in fighting, you're trapped. My forces will overwhelm you, an unending torrent of soldiers. Louse's elites, knights. Elites, elites, knights. Louse's elites, knights. Yep, that's what I said. Houses elite knights are at the ready as well. Dude, I can't read apparently. <laughs> How long do you think you can survive? Raven Kerr! Oh snap. Oh snap. Oh snap. Who's the green dude? Is that me? No, that's not me. I'm, I'm the dude in the robe. A word of trouble you bleeding yourself in, yes? Ooh, you startled me, old woman. You should get out of here. This is going to be a bad place to stay if you plan on living. I want to see the one searching for her father. Marcus for race, sir. Listen up, old woman. You're close to death as it is. But you're yammering to move on. Hector, you should mind your manners. Hey, Mellywood, may I ask your name, my lady? Woo-hoo-hoo. <laughs> What a polite young man. 
I am Hannah, a fortune teller. I came here to help you. Can you tell me when my father is gone? No, but I can see other things, useful things. I can tell you what weapons to take into battle, as well as who should wield them, things of that nature. I see. Don't tell me you believe any of this. I have no reason to believe or disbelieve in Hannah's powers. But I'll not roll out anything if it helps me find my father. Lord Elliwood, Lord Hector! I make my living as a humble merchant. If you have any items you no longer need, please let Paul and Melinus take them. <laughs> I'm here too! Speak to me for auguries before you engage the enemy! My services are not free, but they may save you from paying a greater price! Alright, so now they're gonna make me pick units, which is kinda of shitty. Oh, never mind, I can just take everybody. <laughs> Go ahead and look at the map here. We got two Lance buddies. Lance is bad against Axe. Pretty funny, we got Doorcast right there next to both of those. We got two dudes there, got an Archer. What the fuck? It's a bunch of dudes. We got a vendor and an armory down there. Okay. Got a village and a house up that way. Lance dude here. Um. Also two houses here. fort and that's just a fort why do they have forts like way over here they're gonna be like some boat or some shit that comes out whoops my ass i would not be surprised especially since there's a shore right here there's also one here too well technically all right Um, let's centralize. Or these. Let's have both of the axe buddies down there. We'll send the archer to the houses. We should probably find where she's at. This guy's probably just gonna come straight over here and beat the shit out of that dude. Love double axe buddy over here on the lances. Probably send this guy over here to start fighting these dudes and make his way down this way to the shop and all that shit. That dude only has 18 health. Alright, okay. And then. I might just send like the all the foot soldier dudes on this way. We kill these two guys and we just come straight across, I guess. Okay. Uh go back here. There's items of Merlinus is in your party, you can manage items through him as well. It doesn't let you buy anything, you can only sell stuff, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Um I don't really have anything I want to do with anything. I think we're pretty much fine there. Valuable battle information can be viewed here as well as tech 
Tacticianator data. Rank. Well done. Very well done indeed, Dumbledore. We do well to rely on you. Is this good? The funds are apparently the worst thing. The rating and data for the tactician Dumbledore. I'm a one star tactician and nader. Alright. <laughs> Do you seek insight into your next battle? Will you pay my price? 50 gold, hell yeah. Any of your foe will be carrying spears. You should take axes. Yes, many axes. Hmm. And that's. Jewish clear girls with you take her as well. She might well meet an old friend. <gasps> Is Irk the Big Jerk gonna be here? Weather though, it doesn't look good. Be prepared for sudden changes. You know, you should take a rapier. It'll serve you well against many a foe. That is all I see. But maybe you wanna hear it again? Hell no. Is that so? I'll be seeing you soon enough, I'm sure. Yeah, well, I'm, first, I'm forced to take the rapier, so that's fine. Go ahead and say it so I don't have to watch the cutscene again in case something stupid happens. Even though we can rewind and stop something stupid from happening. Uh, I think we're good. Lord Eliwand, shall I join you? To deploy my tent, I can help with equipment. Search items for you and hold them if your packs are full. However, my tent cannot be moved about. If you deploy it, it will require a guard. I beg your understanding. Uh, Lennis's merchant tent can be deployed on this map. Deploy the tent, any items you cannot carry can be sent to the tent. Oh, that's sick. However, the tent is vulnerable to enemy attack. The tent loses all of its HP, it will vanish from the map and remain unavailable until the next map. Where Linus's tent gains one level for every battle it survives. Oh, snap. The tent will be harder to destroy as it increases in level. Deploy Merlinus? Hell yeah. Dumbledore, let me take point. Oh, you will be taking lots of points, sir. Don't worry about that. There may be many of them, but numbers are meaningless. We are knights of foray. These mice of Laos will never defeat us. Irk the big jerk. Hmm, we certainly could send some assistance. Sorry, but it's just not possible. We disobey Marcus. Laos, who knows what might happen to us? I understand. We'll seek our aid elsewhere. You'll find the same answer everywhere you go. Eventually, you'll have to do as the Marcus orders. You would do well to tell your employer the same thing. Mm, good day to you. Erky! Alright. At 20 health. Defeat enemy. 21. Alright, you go over here. Listen to this. Have you heard tell of the Marcus's infatuation? There's a young woman staying in a village on the harbor. Her speech, her looks, everything about her has the seeming of a princess. The Marcus's attentions order on obsession. He sent countless envies to invite her to the castle, but she rejects him at every turn. Now the Marcus's guards around the village keep her in a trap. There's no way to escape. It's so sad. Oh, that's this dude down here? Okay. Hello, would you like to die, please? Uh, sword's bad, right? Still 98 hit rate. He just dies, so whatever. Goodbye. We need to go beat Urkus! Okay. 
X buddies, go. Eight. Blammo. Okay. Let's start. Fifty seven hit rate. Damn. This P buddy's gonna be taking some damage, unfortunately. I'm gonna load up. One res. Can we kill any of these guys? Oh, we can. Oh! Ho, ho. He did. All right. Be defense resist. Nice, nice, nice. I think I'm just gonna send this guy out here and start whooping some ass. Actually, I don't know. Maybe not. Especially not with that archer right there. Put my tail right there. Set up an ambush here. Go here. I don't really want to block everybody out though. Like, if I put him here, he's gonna get wrecked by everybody. If I put him there. Where can the archer go? Oh, nowhere. That's fine. Um, let's just do this then. Let's set him right here so that way the other two can come out. Expected that to happen. Oh, no. This should be fine. Good. Yep, so this coming. Kill this guy with the bunny. Oh, never mind, I ain't doing shit. Ain't doing a damn thing. that dude what are you doing Urkus the big jerkus what's your damage apparently holy shit oh he missed <laughs> uh. Rizzilla has your escort returned yet no let yesterday in search of a way out of here just hope the soldiers of Laos haven't captured him his search for help must have been fruitless! Marcus Laos has ordered that no aid be given to you! There's really nothing that any of us can do. I apologize, but... Oh no, you can turn me over to the Marcus. Yet you continue to grant me asylum. I am grateful for that. Of course, if I simply went to the castle, this would all be over. 
Don't fret over that. None of us are overly fond of the Marcus. He's always threatening us. He treats us like slaves. All of these war preparations, we want nothing to do with them. We may be divided into territories, but we're lickings one and all. We may be invaded by another country one day, but why does he want to start a war here at home? None of us understand what he is doing. All right, we have some decisions to make here. Pirates from that citadel and south keep raiding the nearby village. The Marcus ignores her pleas for help. We're all, we'll all be overrun someday. Someone should go to that village and mourn them. All right, uh, this guy needs some help, but I need to get her over to Urkus the Big Drukus. Oh, 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 there it comes. Oh, that's right, he's like almost dead. Whatever, we gotta save Urky. Nice! Um, she can actually be shot there. He has a lot of health. So doing this might not be that stupid. Doing that would be stupid. Stupid. Stupid! Oh shit. Uh, this guy's level 3, this guy's like level 4. Get rid of this guy. I'm just gonna do this. The only problem is now that I've used a sword, he's gonna have lots of avoidance against the uh, Lancer dudes. Oh no. Uh. Alright, that's fine. Might seem stupid, but we're gonna do it. Um, let's leave dork ass over here by the tent, I guess, with the archer. Only take an eight. Just twice. The other guy's not gonna be able to get to him. The other guy's gonna go to the horse. He's gonna get wrecked! Okay. Like level six now or something? Oh, she's only level four? That was higher than that. Oh, this guy's dead. See you later. <laughs> that was sick. That dude just got jousted.
it pretty much always attacks twice, so. Oh, but do! the big jerky? Uh oh, it's a pirate. Eh, what's all this? Looks like war broke now. Ah ha 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 ha, perfect time for a raid. Up and that mates, so that village is ripe for plunder. The dork ass over here them all in the forest and shit and these Dumbledores this way Erky the big jerky I need your hey up I need to heal this guy too though and this guy I gotta need some health too Um, I guess I don't really want to take the XP from that dude. One off. No, Damage. Nice. And. I the speed. That has speed? Are you sure? Are you sure? Um. Oh, let's let the buddy kill that guy. Idiot, it should be fun. Fine. We'll just kill it with a uh, horse buddy since apparently he's only level four. Or should I go from here so we are further to the left? Hey, dude. Now we're gonna be having them pirates popping up. We gotta thief buddy visit all this shit. I'm just gonna come over here and fight this guy. Cause I already know Dumbledore is gonna be flying over here trying to kill people and shit, so I'm on a preemptive. They're clearing dudes out, and they're all gonna walk up to him anyway, probably. My house is the truth, Lord of Olympia. That's my lance. What are you doing, Erky the Big Jerky? <gasps> oh! Thank the Lord. Oh. Out of my face, dude. Miss? No! Lord Pent, I'm not worthy. A student, after all. Hmm, my bones ache. The signs point to rain, yes? Watch yourselves. 
You know what? No, we we ain't doing that. We're 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 saving his ass. We're doing something different. We're gonna be cheating a little bit. It's fine. Don't even worry about it. I don't really want to do that. I'm gonna go all the way back. There's like no way for me to block this dude. Like I could go here and he would get attacked once. He would just have to survive that. This is gonna be shit. up and attack him which is fine I think she might be close enough to talk to him on the next turn Dead. He running. Mmm, my bones are yeah, okay. Sun's point to rain. It's all rain right now. Bandit. Urkus the big oh he healed! What? Oh you never got hit, that's why. Okay. Oh, the last person I wanted to see. <laughs> well, that's so sweet. You wanted to see me again. Hey, I know. This is perfect. Come with us and lend a hand, Eric. I beg your pardon. Come on. I'll even introduce you to Lord Hector Hollywood. I know you. You're probably just wandering about without work. Oh, Sarah. I'm afraid I am gainfully employed. However, fighting Laos might work out after all. What are you babbling about? Make up your mind, will you? My employer is hiding in a village south of here. Will help me protect her. I'll join up with you. Hell yeah, daddy! I'm just gonna whoop his ass again. OXP for me! It's a silver lance. Can I have a silver lance, please? Oh, my steel lance is almost busted. Give me your silver lance, you piece of shit. Unhand me! I am no one's prisoner! Got a lot of XP for me. Oh, four. One defense. Okay. Silver Lance. Oh, daddy. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so we got a lot of dudes that need to be healed. 
Did I ever go in this village? I didn't. Go battling. What? Who? Battling who? Go battling Eric and his men, right? Let me tell you, I'm on your side. My granddaughter, Marcus Laos, took her away. Found her pretty and forced her to the castle. Not much, but please take this. It's a large sword, so you have to be strong to use it. A bit unwieldy, but it is a mighty weapon nonetheless. Hope you can defeat the Marcus' son, Eric. He's already dead, dude. Who would make our lives more pleasant? Good luck to you. Iron Blade. Alright, we got the Pirates coming up. This dude needs health, this dude needs health, this dude does not need health, so we're just gonna walk him around. Down this way. The XP buddy, he needs health too though. Um, I guess we can just bring her down and around. Student's health. Put him over there so that way she can heal him. I think Big Buddy needs to be healed too, yeah. Alright. Uh, I guess you're just gonna sit back here. To guard the tent. Oh no. Oh no. Actually, this might be okay. Heal him right now. It's like level five, right? Level four or level five? Level five. One spud. Uh, let's move him off the house so Thief Buddy can go to the house. Even though I could have just went to the house with him. Is it true we're battling Castle Ostia? What could that fool of a Marcus be thinking? Else there's no chance of defeating Lickia's most powerful territory. The Marcus' son, Eric, is nothing but a power-hungry dullard. And the Marcus himself is a lecher, plain and simple. What a pair! Do they believe they're a match for an Austin in general? Oh, forget everything I said. We never talked, okay? I'll move it up with this dude. Let's try to get everybody in a decent position for the healer here. Uh, let's just leave him... Here, because she's probably only gonna be able to move around the corner right there. So we'll heal him next turn and then get everybody else near the healer. After that. How many do we got left? We got three, four, five, six, seven, and more are probably going to spawn. Go ahead and end this. I don't want to, or don't want him to go down by himself. So this stumbled door will send him downward. Three down. 
we can get to that village down there. Um, leave him in the forest. Put him in the forest. I'm over here to beat the shit out of this guy. Only got 20? Oh. Damn. Wait, was he on that peak right there? Nope. Or mountain, not peak. Alright, uh... We probably don't really need to guard the thing over here. But trying to get them to catch up now and kinda eh. Oh. <laughs> this rain will end shortly. Buddy, to him down. I wonder if something shitty happens if they get them before I do. If I'm going to do that. to go all the way around. You find that the rain stops after this turn. Yeah, they have no movement right now. We can probably just leave her here, whatever. Go twice? Kill him. More rain, that's good. Put him in the trees. And door. Kill and fire. Uh, let's go ahead and buy a fire. I don't need another heal right now. I think I'm gonna buy a couple of these. Four. Ew. Please hit him. Huge bit. It should be fine. her next to him next turn. I don't really want to engage this yet. I think we're just going to come down this way. damage anyway. Oh! Okay. 
One! Oh! Did you go twice? No. Lame! Uh, this should be fine. This should be fine! Problem is, though, he's gonna get hit by the other guy, probably. Oh, maybe not. Not bad, not bad. That dude's gonna gonna do damage. Not worried about that. I think I backed up over here, so I don't have to worry about the village being attacked anymore. Um... This guy first, since he's more susceptible, susceptible to dying. And resist. Nice, nice, nice. I'm gonna move this guy up to the armory. Even though I don't think he has space. Um. Well, let's do this. Take both of those off of him and him over here. Iron Lance. Somebody's. The Steel Lance was about to break, and the other thing was uh, only 20, the Silver Lance, so we should probably buy an Iron Lance for Big Buddy. Look through and see whose their ability is what, and buy more next turn. I don't want to kill everybody though, so I need to get down to this damn. Best case, we need to get this guy the fuck out of here. both gonna die and I'm not gonna get down to that village. Cause it doesn't say like Sisa Castle or anything. The only problem is, is he's probably gonna go attack Dumbledore. He's got full health though so it should be okay. I just really wanna get to this village first. Okay. Well, so it should be fine. 
I hit him twice. I hit him twice. I hit him twice. I hit him twice. I hit I still have to seize the castle or no? Oh, that's it. Oh, we just go back. Okay. Lady Priscilla, I am pleased to see you well. You too, Eric. Have you been injured at all? I'm fine, milady, if I might ask. I found some friends who will help us. Have you? We'll be joining up with Marcus Foray's son. Traveling with them seems to be the safest way for us to continue our, your search for your family. Eric! Oh, my apologies. This isn't the place to discuss such things. Sorry, but in Priscilla, my teacher entrusted you to my care. When you have reached your goal, I will not leave your side. Thank you, Eric. I kind of want to get to the village first, but uh. Eh? Oh well, it is what it is. We'll just keep going. Come on, Eric, get up! You, you peasants, you can't treat a proper level like this. It's too late for niceties. Be thankful you're still breathing. Eric, you must tell me, where is your father? I thought it said my father, it did not. We searched the entire castle and there's no one here. D -d Don't be ridiculous. My father would not abandon. No, he'd never. Everdale. Everdale? Who's that? Big girl, do you want to die here? I? Hector! Eric, please. You must tell us everything you know. I. I just want to know where my father is. Ephedel. You appeared at the castle one year ago. He came. My father changed. <laughs> Uh huh. And. <laughs> Austin's position has always bothered my father. He felt love's deserved to rule all of Lycia. But he'd never gone so far as to speak of rebellion. Did you say. rebellion? Ethendel had said something. Had something. Had said something? It is those who not said there, dude. Ethendel had something. With it, he convinced my father to set this plan in motion. My father then sent envoys to several other Marcuses. Marcus Foray, he had approved of the idea. What? Never. My father would never agree to such a thing. Believe or disbelieve, this is your choice. That is your choice. Reading is hard. First was Marcus Satarus. Then Marcus Foray's reply arrived. Marcus Foray visited here six months ago to seal his approval. That's not possible. My father and yours argued vehemently that day. Marcus Foray always trusted Ephedel. He tried to convince my father to send Ephedel and the Black Fang assassins out of Lycia. My father would not be persuaded and Marcus Foray left the castle. As you know, he then disappeared. I doubt he's still alive. No! Shut your mouth! Elwood said he wanted to hear everything. My father is but a Fidel's puppet. He'll listen to anything that villain says. Even watch his own son die. Those are the sort of people you're dealing with. Marcus Foray betrayed them. They would not let him live. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh. Wait! Elliwood! Elliwood. My father is alive. And... Cannot believe he supports... Rebellion. There must be... There has to be a reason. I know. I don't believe any of this for an instant. My brother trusted Marcus Foray more than anyone. First, we'll find your father and discover the truth. We'll talk to my brother after that. Hector, I am sorry. Don't look like that. 
Your father is surely alive, right? Yes, of course. Marcus Laus, Black Fang assassins. Now this mysterious Ethanel. I'll find them all and prove my father's innocence. Oh yes, it will be mine. In Laos, Eric tells Ellie word of a plan. A plot to use Laos as study ground in a rebellion against Ostia. Elliewood needs proof to believe these accusations, and so he and his allies pursue Dorin, the fleeing Marcus of Laos. Where that chase would lead, Elliewood could not have known. Yep. Yep, 18. Maybe not. Noble Lady of Kalilin! Oh, snap. That means we're gonna meet old girl again. Blast! Where on earth has that snake Dorin gone? I doubt he's left Lickia yet, but... Hector, it's been five days. The death of Marcus Santarus. Attack on Laos Castle. One of these things must have reached Lord Uther by now. Yet he shows no sign of action. Why? I am sure he has his reasons. My brother has other concerns tying his hands right now. What do you mean? It's Burn. We've received disturbing reports over the past few months. King Desmond is behaving oddly. He sees even the slightest crack in Lickia's defenses. Lord. 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 We believe he'll invade with all of Burns' might behind him. Why did it skip all that? I only hit the button one time to like. My brother has only recently become Marcus, as well as head of the Lickian League. He can't allow another country to see any weakness or discord. Wait, what? Where'd all this text go on the, la the last time? Yes, to present the face of stability and strength, is that it? Yes. It seems every country has a spy working in Ostia right now. They'll want to assess the new Marcus's temperament and skill. They sense anything wrong, word will spread like wildfire. Hector, or the Marcus's brother. Would not being at his side be seen as something wrong? What did I is there like a button to like skip the dialogue in this game? Like just entirely? I don't feel like I've been doing anything but, but press the A button. And like it skipped this whole thing and Buddy popped up and then all of a sudden a bunch of dudes are outside. Like what happened? Like, it's a good thing I went back, because otherwise I wouldn't have seen all this dialogue right here. The Marcus's brother is a well-known lout. I were at court. They'd sense something wrong. You're not too proud of that reputation, are you? Not in the least. Lord Elliwood, Lord Hector! What is it, Marcus? Have you heard something? Yes, my lord. A messenger from the east! Castle Kalilin has fallen to a surprise attack from Marcus Laos! Castle Kalilin! They've struck again. Lord Housen, is he in hand? We've no word on Lord Housen or his granddaughter, the Lady Lindis. I never expected them to attack Kalilin. Lord Housen, Lindis. Lord Elliwood, Lord Hector, what should we do? They might still be alive, right? There's only one thing we can do. We ride to their aid. There may still be time. Yep. There's old girl. Another old girl. An archer buddy. A lady, I return and I have brought news. Our soldiers are scattered from the castle to the edge of this forest. There must be at least 50 soldiers. Are you sure about this, my lady? We barely escaped! Going back to the castle would mean almost certain death. My grandfather is in the castle. I let the castle on his orders, but 
I can't leave him in there alone. Numbers we face, rescuing Lord Houser would be no easy task. I wonder if we can expect any reinforcements. I overheard some of the Laos soldiers talking. They claim that Lord Elliwood invaded Laos and drove them out. Elliwood? Why would he attack Laos? It gets even more interesting. Not only did Marcus Laos abandon his castle, but he left, also left his son Eric behind when he fled here to Kalalalun. That's despicable! He abandoned his own son? But at least we know Elliwood is in Laos. We might be able to ask him for help. Assuming there, there were a way to contact him. We are to avoid being caught. So the best path would be through the forest. Shall I go? I suspect you're right. Horses cannot move well in the woods. In, in woods, not the woods. It'll take you a while, but you can travel lightly. Lady Lindis, I'll go. I can fly above the forest. I can be in Laos faster than anyone else. Rina, you can't do this on your own. It's not possible! Next in my time here, I'm no longer as timid around men as I used to be. And I've met Lord Elliwood before. I'm sure I can do this on my own. It would be terribly dangerous. You understand, don't you? Yes, but... I promised myself I would become braver for you. I'm not the weak little from learning I used to be. I'll be fine. Trust me. You've convinced me. The job's yours, Florina. But you must promise me that you won't try anything impossible. Yes, my lady. Farewell. Be gone. You hear our meek Florina? She sounded most forceful. Beautiful. She's become a full-fledged Pegasus Knight. Yes, she has. All of you, Lady Lindis, that's quite gallant. Oh, all for you. How do you read, dude? When we lived on the plains, I always, I was always her protector. I think it's just like reading out loud. And like, since I, uh, like, my brain is not a multitasking brain. Like, re reading, taking in the information, and then speaking it at the same time is not like something that my brain can fluidly conduct. Apparently. When we lived on the plains, I was always her protector. I know I shouldn't feel sad, and yet... Be gone. Commander Bakker, there's something in the southern skies. Zach, Pegasus Knight? Where do you suppose she's going? Doesn't matter, we've been told not to let anyone out of Kalilin. Archers, advance, bring her down! Hell no! Reach Laos, I must go over the forest and fly north. Then I'll have to... Wait, who are those people? They fly no banner, and yet... Ah, that man in the lead! It's Lord Elliwood! He's come to Kalilin's aid! That's wonderful! I have to tell him where Lady Lindis is waiting! I've spotted the enemy. Why are the archers advancing? They're aiming at something up high. Lord Elliwood, look! Up there, a Pegasus Knight! Ah! Lord Elliwood! Could it really be? Florina, is that you? Yes, I'm Lady Lindis's Florina, fly lower! What? Oh! Ah! Florina! Ah! You hear me? Florina! Lord Elliwood? I... This archers almost hit you! You avoided the arrows, but you lost your balance! I'm sorry, I'm such trouble. I'm just glad you're not hurt. Tell me, Florina, weren't you with Lindis? Yes! Lord Elliwood and Lady Lindis is beyond that force. It's waiting for a chance to assault the castle. Just what? Ah, still, it's good to hear she's safe. He's fine, however, Lord Houston's been captured. He's still in the castle. I see. Let's go then! Someone get up there and scour the area. I want to know if we brought down that Pegasus Knight. She's still breathing. Make her stop. My lord, to the west. We're under the attack. It's the fair and noble Hollywood. He's here, eh? Now's our chance to show Marcus Laos our loyalty. Our opponents are a motley band of fools. They're no match for us. I let the big buddy on the, the white horse. Uh... 
Oh. We get pretty schooly discoly? And she's on a horsey? She uh, is she like a, a mobile healer? Oh snap. Um I'll get rid of her. She's got like yeah, she's got no XP and she doesn't do any damage. I don't want to bring Erky the Big Jerky, but I don't know who to get rid of. Maybe this guy? Alright, oh, that guy bought stuff. Um. And. Wait, Goddess Icon? What the hell is that? Weaponed out. Uh, we're not gonna take this guy, so we can just leave him. Raid and give that to that dude. Um. You know what? Let's give him that, I guess. Oh, he can't use it, never mind. Uh, Alright, anybody else need healing? Ricky the Big Jerky, you can have some healing. Okay. Take him out. Take Urk. I just don't really want to take those two because they're not mobile and they're kind of went keep that are mobile mobile uh i think i might give this dude that sword because he words in What we can do is we can keep her with all of the non-horsey dudes, and then we can keep her with the horsey dudes. All right, let's take a look at the map here. There's a whole bunch of bitches here. We got a village, a bunch of sword dudes, age. I haven't seen any shamans. Apparently there's a bunch of shit down here in the corner. Do I get, uh... No, she's not. Part of the group, I guess. Bonker. Alright, uh... This is okay. Probably just gonna have this dude run around the houses and villages and stuff. Got two slots. This should be fine. Yeah. 
in my game. Damn. My rank. Survival's up. Funds are up. EXP is apparently down. Still only a one star. Hey. I see a new campaign companion. A new companion. Rock apart, strong of will. You must combine your strengths and work together. Lance, yes, Lance Widows are invaluable here. Use the woods well. You, you will need magic guess and wrap ears on hammers as well. So I'm guessing we can buy hammers from the shop. That is all I see. But maybe you want to hear it again? Nope. Oh, is that so? I'll be seeing you soon enough, I'm sure. Okay, 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 okay. We'll save the 50 gold loss for fun. Yes, uh, here we go. Level six? What level was he before? Raise new decoration. It was you all along, wasn't it, Dumbledore? Me, I'm still traveling in pursuit of knowledge. I'll never outstrip my tutor, but I'm getting a bit closer. Well, Dumbledore, tell me what you need me to do. I need you to whoop that ass, homie. Uh, but first, why don't you go to this village? No company seems close it. Better to have friends who support or assist you, isn't it? You have to be close to someone if you really want to get along. Stay close to those with whom you're compatible to strengthen your bond. The reading by a fortune teller will tell you who you're compatible with. But don't become so concerned about it that you forget to fight! Okay. Gonna his ass down this way. Oh, she is here! Okay, what does she have? Okay, okay, alright. Her down there, we start killing sword buddies. To put him out front. Actually, Thief Buddy's gonna get his ass whipped now that I think about it. Um. I'm actually gonna need people to protect this time because they're probably gonna come over the mountain right here. Okay. Did my turn on him. Oh! Weapons are only as strong as the material they're made of. Most of the weapons you have now are made of iron, right? Iron is a poor match for steel and poor steel for silver. Some weapons are weaker than iron ones, but easier to wield. Good weapons are expensive, but they're worth the cost. Basically, what we can do. Red gem, what is that? Uncommon gemstone worth $2,500. Okay. I guess if that's the case, let's just go start taking out stops with these guys. Limelands, iron, steel. Have a long little low. Uh, let's buy a steel lance. 
And a steel bow. Wait, do I even have anybody with a bow? A little archer buddy on the other team. I don't know what he had. I'm gonna pass on that for now. I definitely want a steel answer for Big Buddy. Yeah, he has both. Okay, good. Limb sword, iron sword, steel sword. I don't think anybody has steel swords. Need heal or fire. Buy some door keys. Buy door keys. No doors here. And thief buddy. He doesn't use his lockpick at all, so. I think we're gonna pass on that for now. I don't really need anything out of here. Go to the house. Different shops carry different items for sale. If you find something you've never seen, you should buy it just to try it. Oh, there's no it on the end of that. Okay. By the way, have you been to the local shop? If not, you should drop in. My daughter runs the place. I was just there. All right, here we go. Oh, maybe we're fine. Oh, that's cheating! What? How did he miss? She not times two. Nice. Well, that was sad. All she got was a health and one resist. I have damage. What was this guy? I have. Go level four. Thing. Nice. Just use a steel lance up to get it out of my inventory. like that. Mm. 
Am I getting hit for 10? Probably not a good idea. Probably gonna get javelin the next turn. Oh, he doesn't have a javelin. Ha! <laughs> Never mind. Can't move right there. All right, so that's cool. We're here with the buddy. This is the has been seized by Marcus Louse's men. We don't know what's become of Lord Hausen. We've been saving this for our daughter's wedding, but I serve you better now. Please help Marcus Cullivan. Our Lord needs rescuing. Red gem. Someone selling and selling stuff for money? Okay. Anybody need help? Might as well keep them topped off. Let's see what this does. I didn't even show like a heal number. No, the Madre. I buy on her? Still ants. The sword is still sword. I do dead. Goodbye. Gablelin. The only problem is now they're gonna attack him and he's gonna hit him with the Gablelin and I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. Um... I don't think we're gonna get more stuff spawning, and the only people that can walk that way are foot soldiers, so... I think if we just bring everybody down, the tent should be fine. Question mark. That's a problem. That's also a problem. He's dead. Oh, 
Uh, he should be fine. Two damage. <laughs> Two damage. He's perfectly fine. Well, first things first, we're gonna, uh, kill this dude. On Big Willy! Or Slayer. Ow! Move her forward a little bit and then kill this guy. Level six, I think. I ain't hold shit. Pretty good level. I'm gonna go beat the shit out of this thief. He dead. Not bad. Number door around here. This Vladre. Ah, you there, your Kalalala Knights, aren't you? Marker Slaus's men, the one called Barker. Like a gentleman, but his skill is near legendary. You carry weapons suited to battle at knights? Take this, if you please. Actually, you know what? That works out. That's fine. Oh, she? Evan. I have, I have, or Oh, he's got a steel sword, that's why. Are you one of Hollywood soldiers? You have that look about you. The villagers are saying that you can defeat an enemy in the blink of an eye. When I get older, I'm going to be that swift. Just you wait and see. He's going to be in the next game. Back to all these dudes with him. Six, oh, he's in the forest too. Really worth 10 damage though? Probably not. Oh, 
All right. What was that problem? See that axe dude right there. Oh no. This guy's dead. You should be fine. Off with your head! Oh, he hurt me. <laughs> and then it dead and then he crits. <laughs> okay. Alright, next. Uh huh. Really? I just just need to make sure that that they die. That's all it is. We just gotta make sure it happens. No, the Madre. Oh, he actually would have done one. Holy shit! He's only got an iron bow. That's weird. I guess green is where I can heal. Uh, well... Can he go on the mountain? That's fine, we can just take this somewhere. Your sword, please. There, because he's going to need some help. Oh no, I already visited the village with this guy, that's right. Yeah, let's just attack him here because he's in the forest.
I'm just creating everybody right now. He don't give a damn. Bad. B A double D. Cheat for that? I don't think that's worth cheating for. Already got most of the map cleared. Thunderbolt. I'm just gonna rush the uh rush the castle with the bloody here. Cause he's bad. Right. Got you, dog. Nice. I'm just gonna go in. Oh, 
I'm just gonna win the game. You can't stop me. A better fall before your master. No. No. It's just too good. Mark cuss. We've been defeated. Such a shame. Give me all that XP for me. Level five. Okay. Because <laughs> he definitely needs some more luck. Alright, how we beat the shit out of this guy? Uh, I don't want to move her up there because that dude's got a steel bow. None tame. Don't worry, we like taking damage around here. Seven times two. Doesn't have a lot of durability left on that weapon though. I'm gonna need another staff or at some point. I think this place had a heal staff, right? That dude's got too much shit. Let's send this guy back over. Oh! Who's this guy? <laughs> Who's. Who is this guy? <laughs> okay, let's do this. We're gonna trade this dude. Uh, you hold on to that. And then... <laughs> we're gonna get that guy out of here. Twenty-three. Good. Hey, leveled up, nice. Or that ain't very smart. this guy get to the tent though that's the only problem I can at least do this so that way he's on even footing a problem. I have a level up here, so I can't complain about that. Do I have to get Elliewood to the castle? Pretty sure he has a heal, so I'm not too worried. I'm worried. I'm sorry, Dumbledore. We cheating on that one, because that would... No. Cheating.
Cheating. Cheating. Also, uh, I'm gonna take a quick break before things are happening. I'll be right back. All right. Things are not happening anymore. We can get going here.
Archer. I'm trying to get up here and help these guys. Because I'm a freaking peak now. This guy's gonna have the higher hit rate because of Iron Axe, I think. Oh, maybe not. Okay, let's do this then. I think I might cheat this too, because I want the tenth level if I don't get this. Oh, it doesn't even kill him. What? What are... What did he hit? That's time. Oh, I think they both missed and this guy got hit when he attacked him. Well, that means the tenth's probably dead no matter what. Unless we crit. You can do it, dork ass. Crit. Come on, don't do shit. I don't do a damn thing, dork ass. What's the problem? Tag door gas, a tag door gas, a tag door gas, a tag door gas. I hit the tag. Oh, you missed! Get fucked! Can I see this with anybody? Please crit. Please crit. I highly doubt he's gonna miss again. Oh, 
Oh, no, no. Oh, he survived! I win! Later, bitches! Alright, cool. The tent wins! And a bugger! He was a fierce enemy! Lindis, once we've defeated the remaining foe, the castle's yours! Thank you, Hollywood. Not for your help, I don't know where I'd be right now. All of this happened because we routed Lord Lorin at Laos. Only right that we help. You explain your motives to me, Elliwood. This is about your father. I would do the same thing in your position. What happened in Clellan is not your fault. Thank you. However, until your castle is yours again, I take responsibility. I understand. Thank you. Elliwood, we're moving into the castle. All right. Who's that? Oh, yes. Let me introduce you. Hector. What? This is Lindis, Lord Hausen's granddaughter. Lindis, this is Hector. He's Lord Uther's brother. His brother? Really? Yes. I was watching the way he fights. He's not like you, Elliewood. He's somewhat like my own knights, but different still. He relies so much on power, like he's never been. I haven't. I taught myself how to fight. I have no issue with that, but the way you swing that axe around, you're a threat to your allies. You should be more watchful. What did you say? Lindis, what's come over you? Hmm? Oh, hi. My apologies. I didn't intend to seem so critical. Granted, Hedra style may be a tad dangerous, but there's no one I depend on more. You may think I'm careless, but he's always aware of his surroundings. The more you praise me, the less worthy I sound. Lindus, once you fight alongside Hector, I'm sure you'll understand. I am sure you're right. I apologize, Hector. I am honored to have your help. No apology necessary. I am glad I can lend a hand. Let's go inside, shall we? Dumbledore, is that really you, Dumbledore? So good to see you. Have you been well? Well met, Dumbledore. Good to see you again. Well, this really is a pleasant surprise. Hello, Dumbledore. Has it really been a year? What's wrong, Florina? You needn't hide back there. Um, nice to see you again. I don't suppose you... Do remember me? Everyone who remained in Calaman speaks to you fondly. We're always saying, I wonder where Dumbledore is. Yes, you're right. This isn't the best time to catch up. We're here to rescue my grandfather. Dumbledore, will you help me again? Ridiculous. Even Barker. Lord Ren, it's time to give up this madness. Others, resistance is meaningless. For what you've done, you may never be forgiven, but it's not too late to try. Tell Hollywood everything. Then I've been with Marcus Ostia on your behalf. I... I've... lost. Hurry, Hollywood will be here in no time. Let me speak for you. Blech. None of that now, Marcus Laos needs no troublesome advice. Uh, Lord Effendel! There is no turning back for you now, you should know that. First, Marcus Santarus. And now, Marcus Kalalin. Both deaths on your head. Or on your head. What? It was by your hand that they both died. I... I never asked for this. Yes, I killed them. You... To... trap me? Don't be absurd. I follow my master's orders. My only wish is to deliver your dreams to you. The crown of a united Lycia. Once that is done, dominion over the entire continent. Is that not what you desire? Yes. Yes, of course. The dream is still worth a few sacrifices, isn't it? You're exactly right. 
Our plans may have gone drastically awry, but as long as we have the master's power behind us, we cannot be defeated. We do well to leave now before those meddlesome worms arrive. We leave everyone from Laos, 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 Louis, Lois, Laos behind. We will use them to delay our foe. Everyone, my soldiers? But who will protect me? The Black Fang and I will more than suffice for that task. There's nothing else you need, I assure you. Yes, I... I see that now. Where do we go from here? Apparently like the stream disconnected. Oh well. My internet died. Oh well. To the Dragon's Gate! Our master awaits us there! The master has informed me our hostage may be all we need. If that all goes well, we may be able to perform the ceremony with him alone. Oh, is that so? I suppose we've nothing to worry about. That is correct. Now please, begin your retreat. I have two or three orders to give, then I will be right behind you. You like internets that work? Apparently I don't. Pathetic imbecile. Leila, where are you? I am here. While Elliewood is occupied, finish off Marcus Callalan and hide the body. And we will waste precious time searching for him. As you command. You know, you've only been with the Black Fang a short while. However, you are quite skilled. Look forward to watching you. Yes, sir. In my game. Actually, it works out because I was going to take a break right now anyway. This game's like. I don't know why, like, lately I've been playing a lot of games that melt my brain for some reason. Like, uh, I was playing that Mario game that I haven't went back to because, like, that game, like, my brain would just die on that one, like, trying to, like, keep all of that in perspective and, uh, whatever. Hurts. Hurts my brain. But, uh, I'm going to try to find a game... Like, I'm gonna try to play, like, multiple games. Find a game that's, that's less, uh... Less, uh, brain-breaking. Brain brain is not that good. It, it's not very smart. Overwhelm it with, with thinking too much, it puts down. But anyway, uh, that's gonna be it for now. Here's a sneak peek at the next mission. Even though apparently this is the end of the last mission, so maybe. Uh, but anyway, that's gonna be it for now. My internet's dead anyway, so. We will, uh, figure out what we're gonna do and maybe stream again later or not. I don't know. But that's it. Goodbye.